Hey guys, and welcome back to Tenchu Z, where we last left off. We had to put down a naughty government official, apparently, and uh, we did that in a <laughs> very spectacular way. Anyway, let's continue. The Murderathon. My god, this ninja. She has quite the body count now. So, we took him out. Who next? Still the Ronin list. Okay. Uh, administrator's office. Still the Ronin, Ronin list. Alright. Okay. We'll accept this mission. Um, I guess we're going to go on this mission. Just as is. Agents report that Okinawa is suddenly amassing fresh troops. The troops are being mustered from a registration list of masterless samurai. The growing Okinawan forces are much are of much concern to Goda. Infiltrate the administration office and steal the list. Okay. And let's go see if we can put down some of these naughty samurai. Uh, whilst we're here. This looks like a big map. I'm guessing that bit to the north is out of bounds. Okay. Well, let's have a little look around, shall we? Looks like this gentleman seems to be standing here on his own. So he's going to be our first kill. Hey, sir. Come with me. I'd like a word with you in these bushes here. Or at least my blade papa would like to have a bit of a word with you. Good night, fool. Now the interesting thing about the equipment in this game is you just, you just don't seem to really need it. Now who's this chap? Hello. Really? You just saw me? I guess that bush isn't exactly uh, a great hiding place. Now, can we stand over here? Uh, I guess we cannot stand over here. All right. Well, we're just going to disappear then into the shadows, which apparently is unbelievably easy, really. I say it's unbelievably easy. I think we're just going to take this guy on. Yeah, we can handle this guy. You fool. Probably should have run whilst you had the chance. Well, sorry, dude. You had your chance to run. You had your chance. Nobody blame but yourself. Crimson doesn't have time for your bullshit. Okay, so what else do we have here? Ooh. Somebody's sneezing. Some kind of... Oh no, I think he's snoring. Sounds like somebody's napping. Right, let's have a little listen. There's just that dude walking around. I think so. Oh, someone can smell us, apparently. Should have had a bath, maybe, before we departed. I think we're going to have to take this chap out. Kind of been spotted here. But that's okay. We can bring this dude forwards. That actually helps us quite significantly. Must have been nothing, my man. Must have been nothing. Or was it something? There we go. Looks like you got a little bit of something in your back, dude. Now, hello, what are you doing here? 
Has your slumber been disturbed? Come on, turn around. You know you want to. So, I don't know where the admin place is. I'm sure it shouldn't be that hard to find. Looks like this dude's not going to turn around, is he? Yep, he will. That was silly. That was very silly, wasn't it, dude? There we go. I think you had too much blood in your body. What's that? Ah, an ocarina. I wonder what that does. Probably. Is a way of distracting the enemies. We've got an archer. Meow. Come to mama. Uh, where would you like to die? Let's take you around the corner. Oh, look at that, mate. There's a little bush for you next to the well. Lovely. There we go. Now rest, friend. Now, I still don't really know if we're killing our own guys. I'm guessing we're in Okinawa. Couldn't tell you for sure. Hello. Seem uh, a little lonely out here, friend. Death could be anywhere. Could be on the roof above you. And you wouldn't know. Well, I guess you're going to feel a little bit of a prick in the back there. Good night. Ooh, he dropped something. Dropped a ninja star. We'll have it. Shurikens really don't seem to be great. I did wonder if maybe if we aim for the head, maybe that's more effective. Not really sure, to be honest. Don't know if this game actually takes that sort of stuff into consideration. Maybe it does. Who knows? So, we've got someone else there. Another guard. Doesn't look like we have anyone around here. Ah. Hello. Hey, friend. Again, a bit silly walking around on your own. There's that guard up there. Let's go see. Ooh. Don't think we can quite get to him. We're close to somebody, though. Very close to somebody. And it's not that guard. Apparently. Got to be someone in this building, I suppose. We are kind of hidden in these shadows. Right. Chalk up another one. Good night. Don't want to get that stuff in your mouth, dear. Just saying. You don't know what these guys have. Right, so we've got an innocent over there. Don't really want to... Um... Get in trouble from these guys. So, oh! <laughs> Hello. Don't mind these eyes peering in at you. Totally fine. Alright, I will have that rather long stick of yours, though. Just because. K. 
Come on, dude. Thank you. It's very kind of you to donate to the cause. Not that I think we're ever going to use them. Uh, take it there's nobody in here. Nope. Who saw me? Oh, hello. No, don't fancy it. Don't fancy coming and checking us out. See something mysterious? I don't blame you. Probably not worth it, is it, dude? Well, at least if you stuck your head around the corner and tried to have a go at us, you would have had something looking like a chance. But hey, maybe in the next life, dude. Maybe in the next life. Someone's left their lunch here. Who's in this room? Oh, hello. You're just pacing up and down. Yep. I guess you are. I like the way we can peer through these walls, uh, or these doors, I should say, without getting spotted. That seems ridiculously OP. So let's just wait for this chap to come back this way. There we go. To be fair, I think the character models in this do look pretty good. Character models for the enemies, anyway. Right, let's leave the door open. They don't even react to doors being open, I don't think. Like, it doesn't really matter to them. No shit's given whatsoever. Just like, ah, somebody seems to have opened this door. Strange. I won't worry about it, mate. It's probably nothing. Probably. Probably the wind. Yeah, the wind blew it over. That's it. Never mind. Let's go get your corpse cooling in the in the cool night air. There we go. How's that feel? Does that feel good? Okay. So, what have we got going on in here? So, we've got a f bit of movement. We've got a spear guy. I think that spear guy is on his own. Uh, looks that way. Never mind. Another spear for the collection. Fool. Foolish chap. Right. So we've got a lot of open doors here. Oh, there's a lot of enemies here. A lot of enemies. So it looks like we've got one behind us. We've got two in front of us. Okay. Definitely going to have to take that guy out. When he comes back, there's another spear guy there. I think he might be on his own. Right, that guy goes for quite the wonder. Apparently. Right, what about you? That'll do. That will work. <laughs> Literally, he's just like, open the door to his room. And he's just like, oh. 
nobody here. Nobody here but your impending death. Ah, oh, you've even got a little cubby hole for me to take you into. Lovely. There you go. It's very nice of them to die silently as well. You know, if this is the quality of the uh, Okinawa threat, I don't think we have a huge amount to worry about. Just saying. Alright, let's go take this guy out. Go do him in, in this corner here. Now he'll probably be seen. Right. Quickly get the fuck out of there. Not quite sure who saw us. Ah. Right, so there's a dude over here. Now if he goes and investigates that body that would actually help us out quite a bit but you know I guess that would have required some kind of programming okay that's fine Lunda come with me you can join your friend we're all friends here. In this big old game of life and death. Let's just pile the bodies up. Could probably kill that innocent as well if we need to, but I don't think we will. Definitely don't want to kill innocents if we can help it. At the end of the day, the innocents are coins in our purse. And that gives us another spear anyway. So what's that there? Oh. That's the end of the mission apparently. Alright. Did we even kill enough people? Did we even kill enough people? Uh, <laughs> apparently so. Seriously. Oh, so that only actually counted as one detection. That's interesting. Oh, well. We can acquire some new skills, so that's something, I guess. We're 9% through this game. Because from what I can remember, it does count easy, medium, and hard all, as, all towards that percentage. This game does actually take a considerable amount of time to actually, uh, you know, 100%. And I don't know if I'm going to be 100%ing this game, to be honest. Right, so. Let's see what skills and things we can buy. Stagger. I think that was already one. Ah, voice. Right, copies the voice of an enemy and lures other enemies towards you. Oh, baby. Yes. A swift dash towards. Remaining in low posture. Causes loud footsteps, however. Yeah, so we don't really want that. Oof. This is expensive, but... I think that's worth it. That is definitely worth it. And wall allows you to run horizontally along walls for a short distance. Causes, v uses vary depending on the user. Okay. And boom, slightly widens the attack area of explosives. Eh, doesn't really bother us that much. Okay, so ability settings. Uh, so how... Ah, right. Now, hmm. I 
I think voice would probably be more useful. A little bit of a strange thing. Bit of a strange combination there. Now I'm going to have to try and remember as well that now <laughs> we're calling the enemy and not listening silently for footsteps. That's going to take a little bit of getting used to. But hey, you know, I think that's the... Uh, the main skill that I was hoping to get. So anyway, that was that felt like an incredibly quick uh, mission. But I think we've come out of that with probably one of the most useful skills. Now, I, obviously, a caveat to that would be you need to be careful about calling multiple enemies towards you. You know, but we can experiment with that in the next video. So thank you very much for watching, guys. And as always, till next time.